Coffee chat day 36. Sit down, grab yourself a coffee, enjoy the vibe. I am very tired right now. I, uh, I got five hours of sleep. I've been up since around half two in the morning. It, it's been, it, I, I'm kind of tired as you can imagine, but, uh, you know, we're gonna get this down us. Hopefully that'll pick us up a little bit. Gonna record the rest of the videos I need to record. Gonna get myself a monster. Gonna hit the gym. And then we can just call it, we can just call it quits after that. <laughs> after that, like, the whole day's pretty much done, so. Yippee. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm as tired as I am. Like, I get that I haven't really been waking up early as of recently, but, you know, like, you'd imagine I'd be able to, like, you know, just not be tired. Like, well, at least I like to imagine I could just not be tired, but suppose I am. I've had two of these already. And I suppose that isn't a lot, but, uh, you know, like, it doesn't feel like it's a lot, so, uh, yeah, like, it doesn't feel like I've had two cups of coffee. If anything, it feels like I've had negative one cups of coffee. So hopefully, this will bring us up to even. We'll be at baseline. That's, that's the goal. That's the, that's the dream right there. I was thinking about this like a little bit before I started recording this video. We need to start taking the advice of not trusting everything we see online again. Like we need to start following that advice more. Like we as people, we as a world, right? Because like the other day, well not the other day, it was like a few weeks ago at this point, I saw like little insta comment debate like in the instagram comment section uh talking about oatmeal and how like eating oatmeal apparently reduces testosterone and it's like that's that's not true <laughs> that's just not true that that's not no that doesn't it doesn't work like that well at least i don't think it works like that but um you know, I think a lot of people have bought into that idea. And it's like, why? <laughs> why why are people just believing that stuff? Like, just so easily. It's confusing, weird. Like, really. I was uh, reading through the... Uh, Bible chapter that I'm gonna be reading through today for like my video, right? And uh, man, it got crazy. It got it got crazy. <laughs> it was a uh, chapter 19 of Genesis, and uh, there was a whole paragraph basically just talking about how Lot, the I think he was the brother of Abraham, but you know, like, one of the Old Testament figures, right? It was talking about how he uh, got essentially drugged by his two daughters and then they proceeded to fuck him. And it's like, whoa, okay. What was that about? Why was that there? That's... <laughs> That is, that is wild. Like, it's such a wild fucking thing. It's, I don't even know. Like, after I read it, I just had to take a fucking breath. And sorry that, like, I'm cursing so much. But, like, I was, I was confused by that. 
That got me off guard. That was like a left hook straight to like... That was a liver shot. That, that wasn't even a left hook. That was a liver shot. Straight up. I, I felt my brain shut down after reading that. Like, oh, we gotta process this real quick. We need to... We need to free up the RAM in the brain to just forget it. <laughs> to just forget this. And now I gotta read through it out loud again. That's gonna be fun. And I gotta take notes on it. And yeah, this it's been a good day. It's been a good day. No, uh, but... Uh, like, it, it's about, like, the origin of the Ammonites and the Hoabmites. But, like... No, not the Hoabmites. The Moabnite. The Moabites? The Moabites? Something like that. I, I'll read through it again. And in the... You know, in the other video that's going up today, that will... It will be in there, right? But, uh... Yeah, no, that was crazy. That was that was a crazy thing to read uh, at 10 a.m. on a Tuesday morning. Well, Tuesday for me, again, this is going up on Wednesday. So yippee, we get the we get the whole scheduling thing back. Yeah. <laughs> Like I have said, I am exhausted right now, so that's the reason why this one is a lot. Like, I, I've i been told that the other coffee chats are, like, very slow-paced, and that's what makes them enjoyable, but this one's just, like, very slow. <laughs> I think this might be the slowest-paced one yet. But I tend to think that about, like, every coffee chat that comes out, because it's, like, there's progressively less to talk about. Like, you know, I don't really live that interesting of a life. So it's like, there's progressively less and less stuff to talk about. And it's like, it's really hard to just come up with something to say for like 10 minutes. So I just kind of have to go with the flow of whatever my brain wants to throw out. And uh, usually that works. Like... It, it works fairly well, but, uh, you know, when I'm, when I'm tired, it's like, it doesn't work nearly as well. I, uh, I ate some red cheddar in hope that, in hopes that that would boost my energy in some way, but, uh, I don't think it really is. Oh, I, I didn't even bring my water with me. Oh, no. I was gonna like take a sip of water because I don't know maybe that would help because you know water is like good and we need water and all that. And I've been ignoring that. I've been ignoring the fact that I am a living thing that needs water, and uh, it's maybe not the best idea. <laughs> I already know exactly what I'm gonna get for dinner. There's like this, uh, this really good, like, protein sort of based company that makes like a, like a pulled chicken filet and pasta, right? With 50 grams of protein in it. And I know for a fact I'm gonna get that for dinner. And I am going to munch down. That that sounds really good right now. Tomato and basil sauce. Oh. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. Put it in the microwave for four minutes. Whew. 
nice quick meal and yeah the 50 grams of protein are gonna come in real handy because I have to work out today as I think I said in the in the intro right so it's gonna come in real handy to get like some protein in after because normally I just stick to like getting protein bars after the gym and like sometimes even before the gym to go with the monster but uh you know like they only usually have like 20 grams of protein and I try and follow the uh, one gram of protein per pound of body weight. So that means I need to get 135 grams of protein in. And uh, you know, it, it's hard most days to like get that much protein in just because I don't really have like a very high protein diet. But uh, you know, I try, I try to get like extra protein in whenever I can. Cool. I'm excited for the uh, new advice videos that I'm recording. Like I, I actually think that a lot of the newer ones are gonna be very, like valuable in a way. But uh. You know, they're less about, like, giving practical advice and more just, like, sharing ideas, I suppose. And I like that because, you know, like, if someone gives you practical advice and they don't know you personally, it it's kind of deceitful in a way. Like, it's almost sort of manipulative. So what I want to do is I want to start sharing ideas. So that way it's like people can build off of those ideas in whatever way they think is like good for them. And uh, yeah, I really hope that I can really put out some high quality, high value stuff out there. But uh, you know, it really just depends on who's watching and how I say it and all that sort of stuff, you get me? But hey, I'm just gonna put in as much effort as I can into them and uh, we'll see how other people take them. Coffee's down. All right. Uh, I, oh, I forgot the intro. I for, not the intro, the outro. That's all I have to say today. Keep running when no one else is. Have a good day.